Hey guys, Matt from soundrolling.com. Still in Amsterdam for a few days. Wanted to redo my video on low pass filters and how I am using them. Um, so on my sound devices, well, let me first explain what a high pass filter and low pass filter is again, um, just so I get it doubly right. So high pass filter is whatever you set the threshold at for a frequency, such as 80 hertz. It's gonna let in everything, all the different frequencies above 80 hertz. If it was a low pass filter, then everything below 80 hertz would be let through and everything above would be cancelled out. So there's a couple of advantages, I feel, to having this. Uh, one is you can get rid of very low frequencies that you wouldn't necessarily have in the mix. Um, and it also limits you for, or helps in a way for handling noise, because obviously that's going to be quite deep on the pole. It also gives you um, essentially a bit more headroom to play with because if you take out lower frequencies within the environment around me right now, um, it's going to obviously reduce the level. Maybe only slightly because we have obviously other uh, factors going on which are louder or a different frequency level. But just having those deeper frequencies cut out um, is obviously really good, especially when it comes to wind as well. Um, so usually as the wind starts to pick up, and you start, it starts seeping through your uh, dead cat or anything else like that, then it just gives you that extra kind of wiggle room to work with in terms of making sure you can get rid of that wind and it's obviously not too um, broadband as in the, the frequencies aren't all over the shop. Um, so yeah, that's generally what I do. Generally do 80 hertz on pretty much everything. Um, when it was windy yesterday, uh, I went up to about 110. Um, obviously with the different voices, it, it's obviously colouring the voices slightly if you take away the lower frequencies, but obviously males, um, you could, uh, you'd have to have it lower before it starts to thin out the male voice because the male voice is deeper. And then female voices you can get away with a bit more because obviously they have a higher register or range to work with. So. Hopefully that's covered it and there's going to be more videos today because this video is replacing the last two videos. So, I'll see you next time.